This video will be going through eight more easy full oil cases. So starting off, we'll be having a look at the lightning bolt cases. So these are the small lightning bolt cases. Uh, they sort of look like this. And uh, these are the ones with um, two bars of matching colors on the sides. So with these small um, lightning bolt cases with two bars, we want to have it so that the lightning bolt is vertical and to the left of the cube. So like this. Not like this because it's horizontal and not like this because it's towards the right. So when we have it vertical and to the left, this uh, algorithm is actually just soon but starting and ending with a wide R move. So like this. So the next lightning bolt case uh, is this one here. Uh, once again, it's got two bars, which means that we want to put the lightning bolt vertically and to the left. Now this time we want to uh, look at the bars. So this bar here is facing towards the back, which means that we want to do the soon algorithm from the back. So it's the same algorithm as the previous one, but from the back, kind of like a wide anti-soon. So for these lightning bolt cases, uh, these only have one bar of matching color on the sides. All the rest of the yellows are sort of spread out. So the ones with one bar, we want to put the lightning bolt horizontally and towards the back. Or if you want to remember it the other way, always have the bar of matching color facing towards you. That could be an easier way to remember it. So um, with this one, we notice that the matching colors are towards the right of the cube, which means that we want to use our right hand for this algorithm. So it goes like this. Now once again, we uh, have a lightning bolt case, uh, a small lightning bolt case, and there's only one bar of matching color on the sides. So remember with these cases, when there's only one bar, we want to put that at the front. So um, this time it's towards the left of the cube, which means that we want to use our left hand for this algorithm. Uh, basically the same as the other one, but with our left hand. So here we go. Moving on to the big lightning bolt cases. They're different from the previous ones because they're bigger. As you can see, they take up the whole cube rather than just a section of it. So it's important to remember that with these big lightning bolt cases, there's always one set of matching colors here on the sides. So uh, we won't always want to hold these matching colors at the back like this. All right, so after that's at the back, we want to uh, look at the front and we realize that the yellow sticker is here is towards the right of the cube, which means that we want to use our right hand for this algorithm. So it goes like this. Our final lightning bolt case is this one here. Uh, once again, big lightning bolt, and once again, there are matching colors here at the back. So we want to put that at the back, and this time if we look at the front, yellow is on the left, which means that we want to use our left hand for this algorithm. Uh, same as the last one, just with our left hand, and it goes like this. So finally here we have some cases where the edges are flipped. So this is the first one. Um, I call this the adjacent edge flip because these two are next to each other. And so we want to put these two edges that need to be flipped towards one towards you and one towards the right. And so we want to use this algorithm. So the final edge flip case is this one here. Um, it's different from the last one because these two edges need to be flipped now. Um, I call this the opposite edge flip case because these two edges are sort of opposite to each other. And so uh, the algorithm is actually really similar to the previous one. So it goes like this. So that's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you learned a thing or two from this video. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.